my cookies gone? Into the Hershey bar. Into new Hopefully Perfect. Awesome. Hello, everybody. I'm Matt. And I'm Maggie. And we are Hopefully Awesome. That's right. A positive place on the internet where we nerd out about all the geeky things we love. And today's geeky thing is the 90s. 90s. That's right, everyone. Uh, sorry for the delay getting started. Uh, wow, the camera is like totally way off. Yeah, it's you know what we're coming in hot from a <laughs> special hundredth episode so, last night yep. of uh, going back to Smallville with special guest star Billy. Yeah, I tell you if you weren't here for that, <laughs> you didn't miss anything. <laughs> I it's mean, just, it's good. It's Speaking just too bad. Uh, you see these guys over here, these yes, people yeah. that are supporting it's us over at patreon.com slash hopefully awesome and youtube.com slash hopefully awesome. You can too get access to uh, all of the VHS archives. You can get your name in every episode, get a physical membership card sent your, right to your door. That's right. That's what we do. Yeah. Uh, so, yeah, you can do that by going over to the places I mentioned, which was patreon.com slash hopefully awesome and. YouTube.com YouTube. slash hopefully awesome. Yeah. How's everybody doing tonight? Maggie, how are you doing tonight? No, oh, oh. Well, somebody's happy. We know how happy. Henry's doing. Somebody's happy. Matt put in chat that there's a curveball thrown. The curveball was poop. I feel like I'm going to I'm gonna take your, oh boy. your camera down a little bit. <laughs> okay. Because, <laughs> like... See what and my allergies are, like, on the fritz, too. Yeah. There's more wall <laughs> than me. <laughs> Let's see here. Let, let me grab the let me grab the keyboard here. I'm sorry, everybody. Oh shit! I don't know what I just dropped. How am I? How am I? Oh, I'm having an allergy attack. I need to. I'll have to fix all this back. Like whenever I get God, the studio set. Billy. Well, I just had to have Billy be a special guest star. You know, to have a third person. A third person. Room. You know what? Let's tell you what. We need to bring back up. This is this is what you missed out on yesterday. Look at those guys. Which one is me? Oh god. Uh -oh. It was the VCR remote that I had to get. Uh, that's right. The one on the left. Speaking of the nineties, <laughs> I tell you, I, I don't know. I feel absolutely dead. <laughs> like hey. I am so <laughs> Matt so woke tired. Up, he's like, oh my it's god. Tom. <laughs> I was like, I can't believe. I also, can't believe it's... just where we're we're living at, it has been like hot weather, but it's been so flipping cloudy every day, and it yes. looks like it's going to pour the rain any moment, every but it time. doesn't. Check it out, everybody. We got uh, summer Baja continues with Baja Point Break Punch. Mine is summer Baja keeps going. Baja <laughs> Laguna Lemonade. Mine kind of tastes like carbonated Hawaiian punch. Yeah, I think that's why bad. I don't like it. Reminds it's me not of bad. Vacation Bible School. <laughs> Wait, you don't like Hawaiian punch? I got burnt out on it. Can I uh, can I get you a nice Hawaiian punch? Kapow! Remember that? Kachow! <sighs> Maggie, let's get started. <laughs> uh, so, we got this tape, and I already put it in the... Oh, uh, he what. broke oh. the rules. Rejected. I was trying to make sure I could hear the audio. Eric, oh no, uh, mi amigo. What's up? Here's the tape tonight, everyone. There you go. It is tape twenty six, and sorry. Uh, it's been crossed out. Ooh. It says uh, secrets. It was the shakiest gun in the West, and or Home Alone two, Ooh. but it's been scratched out, which means that is not what is on this tape. So interesting, and I don't think it's the Master Vile tape either. I think I've just been wrong about Master Vile the whole time. Master Vile is not here. Do you remember who Master Vile is from Power Rangers for some weird reason? He's Rita's dad. <laughs> oh, okay. Okay. She's Repulsa, and he's, he's Vile. A, wow. He's a, a Vile. Vile. Vile creature. Oh. <laughs> oh my. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> you. Uh, the tab's already been pulled, so I'll tell you what. Let's, let's go, party. Let's, let's get going. Let's do this thing. Henry's all about it. Ain't no thing, baby. Do your thing. Ain't no Just thing. Just make but sure a you're wine. ahead of the game. Right, Drink you some Baja Blast. What is on the table? One of my students today say, can I go get a drink? A <laughs> drink. I was like, a drink? <laughs> Catch this. We'll be back later. 
It's <laughs> not anymore. He's gonna be in a television commercial. He's like Tommy. I need to he do anything. I feel like I need to fix our screen just a little bit. Ugh. There we go. That's a little bit better. Matt CR says it's time for re rewind Wednesday about re re me re myself. Rewind. Don't Wait, did I record hey. over it? Oh my god, you did with Hunchback and Notre Dame. <laughs> it's him. It's Jason Alexander. Xander, finally. Yeah. Man, I recorded a lot of stuff about. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> I have them in the wrong spots, I think. Yeah, Henry's diaper was a curveball. Yeah, it was. Yeah, I just we had just sat down and no joke. The business. What is this? Is this just like the He making? had already taken care of business. Presented by Target Stores. Ooh, joining the team. You know, my years as an actor have taught me a lot about storytelling. <laughs> I've always found that it's best to start a story at the beginning. That way, the technical... Serenity now! In progress, graphic notice over my face. <laughs> Damn gargoyles. <laughs> <laughs> that's right. Let's start at the beginning. I'll never forget the day of the... Yeah, that's great, George. That's great. Oh, boy. Costanza. I recorded a lot of the stuff about The Hunchback of Notre Dame, and I did not like it. Like, at all. Remember, it's maybe my least favorite Disney movie. I remember, like, of them the actually of the denizons going, of the denizons going and <laughs> uh like drawing notre dame mm. yeah but like i don't know I the story the, was just a letdown i the, think the horny priest just always <laughs> you know and like i don't know the gargoyles and you know it's just a whole it's a whole thing i just i did not just did not care for it. Matt CR, that is so, no truer statement about a baby. What? He says, that's a baby for you. Uh, releasing crap whenever he pleases. <laughs> Let me tell you. Let me tell you. And I hear oh it only goodness. gets worse as they get older. <laughs> you know? <laughs> Nailed it. That seems really low. Yeah, it does. Everything's still jacked up for well, God. Right. <laughs> Where we had Billy on last night yeah. in Smallville. Let me tell you, Billy stuck around until about a little after midnight. And man, are my arms tired. We ain't gone for <laughs> dear life. <laughs> Just stay away. Oh, look at this. Basically, It's computer graphics. Did you know Oliver and Company was the first Disney movie to use computer graphics like, really? in the animation yep. technological advancement with every movie the first sound cartoon hey we can play yeah. that now yeah we can we can't nobody can claim us. that's right it's, it's, it's all gravy baby hey uh you know i'm skipping through this but remember if you'd like to watch this full thing you can check out the archives over at patreon.com slash hopefully awesome yep. or join as a member right here on <gasps> youtube.com slash hopefully awesome there's that mother trucker roy Di disney roy fucking disney that piece of shit hey, it's this over. tape is like oh god say a prayer for it <laughs> <laughs> say a little prayer for you god. Patrick Duffy. oh patrick what? duffy, patrick duffy. Like keep cool with cool those were some winning slogans from past presidential campaigns. Is that campaigns. Joey Lawrence? Any good no. It's not him. <laughs> Bowl? Wow. Wow. Ha ha. You're so funny. I love that I recorded just that. Big help. Oh god, is this the big help? <laughs> It's the Man, Matt really wanted to be part of the big help back in the day. You know, they advertise it. And I'm like, oh, this is going to be great. Henry says he wants to be part of the big help. Hey, if you're hanging out with us tonight, be sure and hit that like button. Yeah, yeah, if you yeah, haven't liked yeah, the stream, yeah. just yet, that lets everybody know, hey. Wow, 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 wow. I like this. And it, and it also, the YouTube algorithm is like, oh, shit, Eric likes this? Well, this, this these people are just like Eric. Yeah. We should they're send just, them over here. They're just not as cool as Eric. Whole, yeah, well, I mean, obviously. 
They're, they're no Matt ZR, if you no, know what I'm saying. No, they're not. An exclusive. <gasps> stick, stick, stickly? Holly it's B. Holly, huh? <laughs> Holly B. Where, uh, Wood. Like, the, like a penis. <laughs> wow. Wow, Matt. Nailed it. How do we feel about Harriet the Spy? I don't remember it. I remember watching it once. I feel like I, I do not remember it. I feel like it wasn't good. I feel like I I was annoyed that the first Nickelodeon movie was not anything related to Nickelodeon that already existed. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like they have all that. Like they could have done anything from all yeah. that, you know, or like any of the Nicktoons. Yeah, Instead I think they, they were learned, like, "Let's do Harriet the Spy." Let's do this book. We got was, the rights to it. What was the second movie? Was it Snow Day? Is that the second Nickelodeon movie? Sure. <sighs> to be fair, Larissa was was hot, so Matt probably records stuff due to Alex Mack. <laughs> I mean, I love it. You're not wrong. Oh, is this Adult Swim? Like the oh Pete and Pete episode? Yeah, it is. Yeah. His mouth is strange. Movies. You're looking happily. Be Movies, right. films. <laughs> I said, I said, I said, I said, Do we ever find out why the mom had a metal plate in her head? I don't know. See, I didn't get to watch the Adventures of Pete and Pete a whole lot. Oh man, Maggie, let me tell I, you. Listen, when it was on, I I watched it, but okay. it was very, very rare. So good. Here we go. Oh, there's Mr. Swirly. <laughs> or wait, no. What Mr. are you Frosting? going on about, wait, sir? What was his name? Because Swirly was on Doug. Doug. So who wants this guy's name? Is it Phil Mr. Frosty? T Tasty? Mr. Mr. Tasty? Maybe that's his name. Harriet the Spy. Hang on, Good. Hang on. Hang on. <laughs> Wait. Forgive me, Pete. It was the unmistakable sound of Mr. Tasty's... Tasty. Mr. Tasty. <laughs> so... Order of Nickelodeon films. Number one, Harry the Spy. Number two, Good Burger. Number Good Burger was the second one. Yep. Wow. Basically a year apart. Harry the wow. Spy was released on July July tenth, nineteen ninety six, and Good Burger was July twenty fifth, nineteen ninety seven. Wow. Then following that, Rug the Rugrats Rats movie. Yeah, that sounds right. Following that, about. Snow well day. over two years snow, snow day. day and then clock stoppers then rugrats in paris the movie. ah fuck then the jimmy neutron Bo boy genius genius I, movie mm, i'm not a fan of then jimmy neutron clock stoppers clock stoppers i enjoyed jimmy neutron i mostly like the side characters uh sheen and oh, i can't think of the other one's name i thought they were hilarious hey arnold the movie was in 2002 uh the wild thorn to berries movie was in 2002 mm. Mm -hmm. rugrats go wild in 2003 which was not my favorite bruce willis yes yeah. spike the dog the spike the dog hey i'm spike i'm a dog spongebob squarepants movie <sighs> goofy goobers yeah <laughs> 2004 wow Lemony Schnicket's a series of unfortunate events. That's a Nickelodeon movie? Yes, yeah, the first one with uh, Jim Carrey. I feel like this shouldn't have been considered a Nickelodeon movie. Yours, Mine, and Ours is in 2005. That's a Nickelodeon movie? Yeah, it is. The hell? Uh, Nacho Libre, 2006. I, okay, I did know that. Barnyard in 2006, <laughs> which has confused many children growing up thinking that all cows... What male or female? Male or female have udders. They all got. It. They all got it. You know what? what? I mean? They did Charlotte's Web. <sighs> I feel like this tape is gonna explode in the VCR. Dude, we, what you bear? Do we have a fire? No, we don't have a fire extinguisher. <laughs> like, just it keeps like. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> uh. Uh, that's about. I mean, the ones that we knew, like grown up. Maggie, what's your favorite Nickelodeon movie? Hey, it's I, all that. I mean, I enjoyed Good Good Burger. I actually got to see that in theaters. Good Burger was great. 
Um, my cousin got the soundtrack at I Walmart did, afterwards. I did like Clock Stoppers. I love Snow Day. Snow Day, Snow Day was great because like loved it. I was right at the perfect age for Snow Day, yeah. where it's like I'm starting to, you know, but you want to go on dates and shit. But just, I'm still watching yeah. Nickelodeon stuff, you know. Um, so you mean Carl, Maggie? Yes, Carl. Yes, yeah, Sheen and Carl <laughs> together. And yes, I watched the Planet of Sheen show. Nickelodeon seemed it was the best in the 90s, the oh, most no. variety. Yes, that is true, Princess Ichigo. I like your name. Yes. Love it. What is this? Is this Brink? <laughs> no, oh, wait, Harry no, it's Harry the Spa still. <sighs> Dawn. Dawn. Wait, is this is this like a making of Harriet the Spa? The stick stickling? Boy with English. Man tattoos. Profiling. I wonder like if I can play this. <laughs> I say no. Wait, was that? I thought that Harry really liked Is that I love to read. Gerald Garner? 285 no. pounds. No. Are we sure? That kid, the other kid, no. That's this not kid him. Right here. No. Oh, uh, no. I told you. Who is that? Oh. He's somebody. He's been in something. Oh, he right. My goodness, buddy. Are you wanting to see the TV, bud? I would like to see the baby. He hears us talking, but he doesn't know what it's about. I feel like I've it, seen him on something. Maybe Lucy's more. been here. <laughs> Lulu. What's up, Isn't Lucy? Dakota Fanning in Charlotte's Web? Yes. Oh, uh, yeah. I found it cool that Tiny Toon Adventures had reruns on Nickelodeon, even though it didn't come from the network. <laughs> and print, that's also from Princess Ichigo in this, too. One thing I love about the 90s Nickelodeon is that if one didn't like one kind of show, there was another kind they might like. There were yeah. so many genres of series. Yeah, that's true. They really, I mean, they, they did uh, a lot. Man, this tape is... I'm telling y'all, you gotta, you gotta send some positive <laughs> energy and vibes towards this VCR. I mean, I guess it's just tape. because it's so old. I mean, this tape is almost, what, 20... No, 30 years old? Hello. Yeah. Hello, Mad Seymour. 96. What? This tape's from 96. It's, it's 28 years old. That makes me want to barf. Oh, my God. I'm old. I'm old. I'm almost as old as Stick Stickly. <laughs> Actually, I'm older than Stick Stickly. Stick Stickly is probably a piece of paper now. Carl's voice actor Rob Paulson is pretty well known. Yeah. Rob Paulson. Yeah, Yakko. Ash, Ash Paulson's dad. <laughs> uh, he was also, uh, which, uh, not Power Ranger. Ninja Turtle. Uh, which one was he? <gasps> yes, the Rescuers Down Under, Matt. Can't, can't play it. Oh, no, you can't. But yes. I love, I love the Rescuers Down Under. That was a good one. Hey, wait. That's... This is an SP. What are you scared? Come wait, on. no, that's not who I thought it was. I thought it was Anthony Michael. <laughs> Here lies good old Fred. Man, a great big rock fell on his head. Look how much better this is in SP. <laughs> it was Catwoman. You're right, Eric. Here we go. The older lady you saw that you went yikes. <laughs> uh, <laughs> that was Catwoman. Well, also, she, it's more than bouncing. Not really like her but just the things she was doing what the hell is this is this disney's inside out look at henry <laughs> he's in trance he's really he can't even hear this. anything he's just like what it's like wait i see a baby inside out i love this show why is mickey flipping us off what the fuck buddy <laughs> whoa hey, hey, back at you <laughs> Who is this guy? He's like a game show host or something. That's how I feel he is. 
George, don't do that to me, okay? okay. I thought you were a ghost. We're looking for our ghost. <laughs> oh, oh. Oh my goodness. No where I turn, the eyes just keep following me. Well, it's quite simple actually. It's an optical illusion. Um, it's a concave bust of a face. Surely this won't get us claimed, right? It shouldn't. Put your hand all the way through the Let's know if if we go black, everybody. <laughs> like if it goes dark. If it does, we'll come back. Like don't worry, but just let us know if, if <laughs> before we stop being loud. What are we looking at? These are our singing busts. Would you like me to show you how they work? Yeah, I'd love Okay. These are a singing bus. Do you remember, remember, like to see how they work? I really liking this show as a kid. <laughs> and now, not so much. But it's probably because I've just, you know, I know We've all this been shit there. Now. We know the magic. Oh, it's so great. Man. <laughs> I missed it this year. <laughs> Dude, like, it was literally, what, a year ago? <laughs> yeah. Like, this week? We was down there? It's so good. Uh, yeah, I love the Alice in Wonderland show that they had on Disney Channel back in oh, the day. Oh, yeah. Princess Ichigo. <gasps> what? Let's go, Mark Summers. What about what would you do? Why did I record this in SP? He is now, like, probably halfway running Food Network now. Because <laughs> he was, like, a producer on, like, Gaffieri show and... Robert Irvine's show, Restaurant Impossible, and like there's one episode of Restaurant Impossible. Mark came out; he was in one of the vans oh, watching, wow. and he's like, "You've got to fix this." He's like, "We need to help these people." How old are you? When was your birthday? Oh, how adorable! And you are Charles. Charles, are you alright? Yes, I am. Yeah, okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Are you okay? Also, really like Raph. Yes, he was Raph. And was Donatello in the 2012 Nickel? Yeah. 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 All wrapped up. Well, what would you do if I asked you to turn your. Yeah, because remember, he voiced. Would you do it? Yeah. Both. Yeah. In the, yeah. It in was so point. funny. Yeah. Yeah. Because <laughs> didn't want the like they so one of them said it was I think it was Mikey said don't you all sound the same yeah <laughs> they both got annoyed. All right. What's what's oh they're the... gonna wrap up mom make her a mummy oh uh, a mo a mommy ooh I love the mom's shorts jorts they're very interesting especially the high waist it's, wait i'm confused what do they like i don't i don't understand what's going on <laughs> with their shorts yeah i don't know man but i like them <laughs> like it, it, it's almost like they're uh what's it called like uh you know where it's like it's a like a your... collar <sighs> no <laughs> Like, you know, like uh, the things you wear, you know, like a like an old railroad guy would wear. You uh, know? Suspenders? Yeah, but like, but when it's all one piece. Overalls? Is it overalls? Is, that <laughs> Is there overalls? It kind of looks like they're overalls and she just has the, the part that goes over her yeah. shoulders down. More pies over there, and you know what you're going to get to do if they're not successful? You and your wife are going to grab pies, and you're going to hit your kids in the face. <laughs> get them! Yeah, I like this. Oh, oh, oh man, <laughs> parents just don't understand. No, they don't. Oh. Oh, oh that's so cute. Whoa, whoa, girl, whoa. Strategy, girl. Trying to get Strategy. It. She's trying to get it. <laughs> that mom's laughing. So. See what I mean? Uh, okay, there's a belt. I'm oh, still... yes. Oh, my God. I love these shorts. <laughs> there's so much to unravel with these shorts. I love it. So much to uh, unwrap. Um, coveralls, Eric also calls them. Coveralls. That's what my dad calls them is coveralls. Is that, are they called overalls? Is there's that... overalls, coveralls. They're the same thing. Except, like, like to like me, when, you when somebody like, says coveralls, I think they're more, like, work-related. Are we sure this, that we're talking about the same thing? <laughs> like, when we're, like, like, you got, like, like, the things you got when you were pregnant. That were, like, jeans. It's, like, jeans. It's overalls. That's what they're called. Yeah. Oh. 
And coveralls, if if I'm not mistaken, are like long sleeve, like their pants. My dad's got some for winter time. They cover all. They cover all. Now be careful, cause you can break somebody's nose by throwing a pie. I always wanted to get a pie in the face, man. It happened to my brother at VBS one time. That was like the goal. Like if the girls won, that they got to pie my brother in the face. Well. There you go, Princess Ichigo. I feel like they got the same deal that did the Clarissa Explains It All theme song. Yes. Yeah. What, what, what would you, what, what, what would you, what, what, what would you do? <laughs> Whoa. Uh, we're jumping around a lot, man. Yeah, live. I used to live at it sometimes. <laughs> I always wanted to, like, have my own channel. Yeah. Huh. And now I do. Now you do. <laughs> the show f sucks ass. <laughs> You know Welcome, what, Maggie, Jeebs. <laughs> what, what would you do if if you were sitting in that audience? I'd be like that kid that's sitting there holding their face up like this, <laughs> like, really? <laughs> I'd be like, man, this uh, getting out of the sun, not really worth it. I think piano a la carte. What does that sound like? Play it. That's it. Play it a little okay. bit harder. There we go. Play the symbol. Oh, that's beautiful. You have this. Hang on now. Hit your hand with that. Ooh, that's great. Now that's called a ratchet. Now twist the ratchet. Okay, now you have the pop gun. Now just Oh my god. You gotta push it kinda hard. Why don't we give the pop gun to the big guy here? Okay, take pop wow, butthole. Like <laughs> what a piece of shit. Like you have the best wow. Wow. You have a whistle. I hope it's been cleaned. Give the siren a Whoa, all right. Oh my god. So mad that they don't have the show on Paramount Plus. <laughs> yeah, Maggie, you're on it. We have coveralls as uniforms in the Navy and they are long sleeves. Hey. Oh God! What is this? Um, we haven't went black yet, thank God. <laughs> I'm thinking about fast, fast forward. forward. <laughs> this I mean, is going to be bad. Like. This is going to be bad. My God! What's great is that they didn't feel the need to cut any of this out of the final episode. No. You know. They're like, nah, it's fine. It's fine. That's okay. Right, Otherwise, this <laughs> audience gonna know that the whoopee cushions have to be blown up, you know? What a set. Like, can we just appreciate this set? This set's amazing. And also the fact that they had tours going <laughs> the whole entire time. Yeah. And Mark Summers even said when he's interviewed, he's like, we had to like pretend sometimes that we were doing a show <laughs> or pretended that we were in makeup. <laughs> All right, here we go. All right, buddy. Come on. Eric, what can you do that Hokum W. Jeeves does? Matt is like, this is a train wreck. I can't watch away. Let's see what happens. Eric, go. what can you do? Here we go. Ready? What can Ready? you do? You're going to play when I point to you. I hate, that everybody, everybody's like hating this. Television at its finest. 
<laughs> that was the worst thing I've ever seen in my life. Oh my god. That was a garbage truck on fire. I loved it. Because <laughs> that, is, that is crap that I experience day to day. Like you expect kids to do something right. It just doesn't turn out the right way. <laughs> Babies. And dads are always trying to make them laugh. Boy, there's a tough customer. Hey, Dad, show us how you play with your baby. Ready? Go. <laughs> what on earth? <laughs> Man, your face is cracking me up. Where are you? Think? That was a newborn. What on the crap? The building that this show's happening in, Blue Man Group's there. <laughs> this show sucks. <laughs> what the hell happened? You can pedal like Jeeps. Wow. I'm impressed, Eric. Right over here. Let's hear it for them. Hi, sir. How are you? Where's your wife? She's out of the dunk tank. She's, oh, she's out of, oh, in case Jason, oh, uh, I see. Now, uh, you dried off pretty quickly there. Is the water cold? Uh, and I need to pick another lady over here to help me out. Uh, this young lady, hi, how are you? Nice to see you. Come on over here. Now, <laughs> now you don't have any problems. I swear to God, I thought that was Michelle Obama <laughs> for a second. <laughs> that would have been great. To lose my goddamn mind. <laughs> that would have been awesome. Very nice. Now, uh, if you are within three Hidden months, footage. Uh, stays dry. Now, Jason. <laughs> Uh, anything that you'd like to say to your dad before he makes this uh, choice? Right. Uh, huh? Guess right? <laughs> now, Jason, turn about his fair play. Uh, how much do you think this young lady weighs? <laughs> uh, God! Guess right! 400 pounds. Why don't you get on this and see if indeed it's anywhere near 400 pounds? Oh my gosh! About 100. Oh, you were only 120 pounds. 220 pounds off. That's all. 220, something like that. So. Uh, he just made that lady weigh herself? Yes. That's awful. Mark Summers, what have you done? <laughs> and then I'll, they play this jam. I think it's just the song. I think the song was great, and it carried the whole show. <laughs> Oh man, look at that. Made you forget everything that you just watched. Wow, Matt, live edited. What would you do? We have time for a short medley today, and I need somebody. Why don't you help me out, sir? Right over here. Clarissa right theme composers were Rachel, Rachel Sweet, and Anthony. Claire, what would you do, but I'm not about to attempt that Sorry, last name. Willa uh, Basson and Jason, Rachel performed it. Checked. Um, no ties okay, to the show's okay, theme. Ah, uh, son of a bitch. It said you have to eat a sauerkraut and jelly bean sandwich. Go over there. We'll find somebody to do that in a second. In the meantime, hold them. What are you going to do? The Poor kid. I'm going to go for the card. Oh, you're a good man. Take it off there. It says, hidden talent. Do you have more hidden talent than we've already seen? Oh, yes. I do impressions. <laughs> what are you going to do? Oh, I'm going to do my impression of split pea soup coming to a rolling boil. Yeah. All right, go ahead. Okay. Split pea soup. Split pea soup coming to a rolling boil. Somebody's gonna eat a sauerkraut and jelly. Is this the one? This guy is lame. <laughs> I don't know why you want to do this. What's your name? Eric McKeeby. Eric. From where? Eustis, Florida. Eustis, Florida. <laughs> Get it. Uh, Eustis, Florida. Oh, my God. Sure, why not? Okay, here's a man who doesn't oh, mind uh, fuck. having a good time. All right, big chunk there. Big, big bite. I can't watch. Oh, oh, he barfed. Okay, you can spit it out over there. All right, well, we're gonna oh, my God. <laughs> Ew, all the kids were ew. <laughs> Dude, you always pick the power pod. Always. Always. Okay, on the count of three, look straight ahead of that camera. We're going to finish our show today on what would you do? One, two, three. Here's point number one. Point number two. Okay, for real though, this might be lost media. This is. Oh, do I feel like I know this? This is Boney runs for president. A Wienerville oh. election special. <laughs> Boney, 
Hey, this is Wienerville. Do you remember Wienerville? I remember it, but I don't. I didn't watch it. Wiener. The future of Floridians. <laughs> Flor- yeah, Floridians. Wow. wow. Here we go. Wait. Talk about another banger. From Washington, B.C. <laughs> so get ready. Get ready. I forget what the words are. Get ready, get ready. Get ready for the I recorded this on a tape recorder because I just like listen listening to the music. I think it's like with a plate of spaghetti. It's getting kinda sweaty. Get ready for election day. Wow. Offering a new challenge for millions. Uh, D. Bradley Baker, voice of Almec from Legends of the Hindu Temple, was one time a guest on What Would You Do? Nice. Huge magnet? Is that what that is? <laughs> is that what I think so. I'll show you. I'm here with lovable Zip. Zip, what's your staff strategy? We have to find a way to start off this campaign with a bad <laughs> Zip? Zip! Today's pony. What do you want? Hi. Dude, let me tell you. All right. Jeff Dunham wishes he could be a pony. <laughs> oh. And show the world. They've been wienerized, Maggie. This could be interesting. Wow. I'm scared. <laughs> or presidential. Pony. You have to tell the voters what you're going to do for them if you're elected president. <laughs> I fucking loved this as a kid. And it's awful. Like, it's is, awful. <laughs> Eric asks, is this like the Purge movies, the <laughs> Muppet edition? <laughs> God, yes. God, man. The band is up, is up, what's it is I probably shouldn't play that. No. I prefer Gump. But that's just me. Okay, you need to... The music, Matt. This is amazing. Uh... Ah, oh, I feel like that guy. That dude sucks. <sighs> we need a scandal. <laughs> Was that Clarissa's dad? It looked like Clarissa's dad. Oh, uh, more Harry at the spa. I'll be honest, I did like her, her spa toolkit. I thought it was cool. One more thing. As spy, it's important to keep the tools in your trade from prying hands and eyes. For this, a little shoe polish can go a long way. That's Dawn. I know. Oh, 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 
and shoot up by the spy and celebrate Nickelodeon's first movie, Harriet the Spy. Do you think Harriet the Spy was actually like already in production from Paramount and then they were like, fuck. Let's give it to Nickelodeon. Well, and now back to Nickelodeon Wienerville. I love it. I love Wiener. Bony hates kids. That's the scandal that got made up. See, was that? I swear to God, that was Joe Biden. I... Oh my God, it is. <laughs> it's Joe Biden. Let's see what he says. Nandi's Joe Biden. We love Bony. We love Bony. Hey, Jocko, where's our candy? Oh, those kids. <laughs> Thank you very much. We've got a solid answer. Hey, Taco! That was funny. Wow. Wow. Well, let's get back to it. What's up with that old man? Let's get this campaign rolling! Boney hated everyone. (laughs) That was his whole thing. His catchphrase was, I'm Boney, I'm Boney, leave me alone. Wow. Ah! They wienerized Abraham Lincoln. The statue of him. Don't give up the fight and don't go to that debate without liberty. And- Do you know this this dude? I forget his name. Mark Wiener, maybe. Yeah. Uh, he was on an episode of uh, Brotherly Love, and uh, the Lawrence brothers got wienerized because they had to fix his van or something. Uh-oh. Yeah. Hey, it's Stick Stickly. This is terrible. I love it. I can't wait to watch this later in the archives. Or you can watch it too. Uh, just go to patreon.com slash hopefully awesome. Uh, or become a member here on youtube.com slash hopefully awesome. Get access to the Google Drive archives. Oh, okay. Yeah, Mark. <laughs> yours are up. Take it out! Americans, Bodies running for president yeah! on the Wienerville election special. Next, only on Nick. No, no, we just watched it. Yeah, that is Clarissa's dad. <laughs> Yankee Doodle came to town and ran on a the bony. <laughs> Who needs Linda Elderby when you... <laughs> that wasn't even her name. I'm pretty sure I got her name wrong. Get out of here! Get out of here! <laughs> <laughs> what? Holy fuck! Oh my gosh. I didn't record Beetlejuice. Suck. Maybe. It's Weevil from uh, yeah, it is. Veronica Mars. 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 What? I can't talk. If you're a genie, then make it rain candy from the sky. I liked Kazam. I enjoyed it. Everybody hated it, I feel like. Really? Yeah. I liked it. I, I feel like it. as a kid, you had to like it. Yeah. Like Kid in the 90s, she it's got Shaq. Got Shaq. Rain's candy. What more do you need? <laughs> I mean, you know, come on. Not to be more of a nerd, but Mark Wiener was actually the voice of Matt. Matt and Swiper on Door of the Explorer. Oh, wow. That's correct. Swiper, no swipe. Swiper, no swipe. Oh, man, it's that sports theater. Oh, yeah, Shaquille O'Neal. Shaquille O'Neal Sports Theater. 
I'm never going to be tall. Um, don't hope to be as tall as Shaq. <laughs> oh, man. Hey. Hey, Keenan. Like, how many episodes were there that we looked up? Like, three? Three, I think. But, like, they were spe- like, it was special, like, one-offs. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, like, it wasn't an ongoing series. It was more like a, hey, kids, Shaq's doing stuff. You should watch it. I don't even remember what happens in this. Like, is it like the jersey? I want to be big. Does he like, does he grow like eight feet tall when he wears a jersey? Hey, was that? They got me up. I think one guy's in One Tree Hill. Mm. I think. It's been a minute since I watched One Tree Hill. (sighs) Yeah. Young Matt. What cut, were you doing? Cutting all the commercials. What were you, you know, doing? Leaving us with Matt? nothing. How dare you? Nothing to watch. Trying to here. save every bit of tape there is. <laughs> and yet I wasted so much SP time on what would you do? <laughs> oh, man. Ah. You having fun? <laughs> do you wish they would have made uh, like a Space Jam 2? What, back then? Yeah. Yes. Well, yes. who... Dan Marino. Well, go football route? Yeah. I mean, I feel like that's, all, yeah. that's the only way you can go, right? Oh, uh, yeah. I think so. You do Dan Marino, and you make it football. Yeah. And there it is. Maybe the Tiny Toons come in. I kind of like that. Yeah? Yeah. You could call it Turf... Turf Jam. Turf Jam. <laughs> that one guy from... Nick Sports Theater was from Ke- Cousin Skeeter. Yeah, 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 yeah. The the main kid. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I was like, I can't place this kid. Yeah, because we talked about him. Like, that's what yes. made us uh, think. Because he was in, uh, was he in American Society? Is that where we saw him? I think so, yeah. I think. I think so. Something sparked us. It was before we went and watched that. Because well, you was trying to figure out the sports theater for some reason. Yeah, so. yeah. 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 Yeah, boy. I ate those one time. Mm-hmm. I did too. Complex. Hey, hey, Rookie. Right yeah. off. One of over 30 off the wall DZ games going on all summer at Discovery Zone. <laughs> Discovery <never> Zone. <laughs> Discovery Zone near us. <laughs> I always wanted to go to Discovery Zone. <laughs> Bless you. Because you're either in the zone or you're not. I mean that is true. In a box. In a box. When satisfying your when, what did what did Mark Summers call <laughs> What did Mark Summers call it uh quality television, Matt? Kellogg's Rice Krispies Treat Squares. I don't know. <laughs> Is that it? I don't know. Sl- oh, you said it. Got it. Oh. Slime time. Should we start sliming each other? No. <laughs> I'm not cleaning up slime. <laughs> that crap sticks to shirts. It's true. Ah, oh, fuck! Wear a helmet! Wear your fucking shin guards, you wear piece of shit. Your knee, knee pads and elbow pads. Wear it. Stay right there. Nick Lowen Sports Theater will be right back. Shack but you pack. know what? I lived Shack's on back. mountain dirt Shack, roads. Shack Pizza. I didn't wear a helmet. <laughs> Shackaroni. R.I.P. Shackaroni. <laughs> Salude. Gracias. I don't get it. I, I sneezed. He's oh. telling me, bless you. Oh, I thought that was the. I thought that was the punch line. The punch line. <laughs> I don't know what does Mark Summers call quality television. Good, good Something. eats. Good eats. Good eats. Good, good diners. TV drivers. Drivers. Diners, drivers, and de- da- dons. Doms. Hey, uh, everybody, dons. get this. I got some donkey sauce <laughs> All yeah right. he did holy crap and that stuff's addictive so good uh, it's at, it was at Walmart yeah 
Oh Tasmania? my god. Man, I remember. Come to this. Tasmania. Show me Tasmania. This is how we do it. Mm -hmm. uh, ah. Welcome to Atlantis Way, under, down, under. It's going to always do it, you know. It's that wacko. Yeah. Down into Tasmania, come to Tasmania. Yeah. Top in each turn, they stop to spin like a Tasmanian devil in his closest can. All right, okay. His closest can. What a show. What a show. Wow. What a show. Warner's like, let's milk Looney Tunes for all it's worth right now. Because this is pre Tiny Tunes um, or post Tiny Tunes. Well, it's 97. Well, I mean, it's not necessarily new. No, uh, the Wienerville thing said copyright 1995. Well, but odds are, since it was an election special, it probably came out in 96. So this means this tape is probably from 1996. If I had to guess. If I had to take a wild guess. He's just like, I'm going to fall asleep right here watching TV. <laughs> Aww. There he goes. He's so cute. He's the Flash tonight. I never really, like, I mean, I liked Tasmania, but, like, I didn't really watch it that much. I didn't get to watch you know? it much. I feel like it came on at a weird time. Yeah. I feel like it was one of the, like, a uh, syndicated like yeah. it, you know, so it came on at like two. Yeah. Instead of like, you know, after school, you know. Yeah. Like Sonic the Hedgehog. Yes. That that came on during school time. I remember one time like waking up really early on a Saturday morning. It's me, it's Baby's Red. Why do we have to take a vacation, Dad? I don't know. Well, that's because that's what... It's Mr. Mixlepidilic. Howie Mandel with hair just still freaks me Look, out. Look, it's him also. Uh, well, it's me, baby. Hi, I'm baby. I, love... I want to know the story behind getting this show. It was the 90s. I know it was the 90s. I just want to know. Either, if you were a comedian, you either got a sitcom or you got a cartoon. Well, that was it. Louis Anderson's show. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Life with Louie. I'm going to look it up one day. That was the uh, two this, routes, Maggie. That's you, what I'm going to do during my planning. That was the two routes. You either got a sitcom or you got a cartoon. Just depending on your style of humor. Isn't that what he said when the whole whoopee, whoopee cushion thing just played at <laughs> what would you do? Oh, yeah. yeah Sorry. Like, Sorry. You got to forgive we're us. Dead. We're dead. <laughs> I'm Matt's sorry. brother came over for Smallville last night and And we all died. We just died. I wonder how Billy's doing today. Uh his shirt showed up. <laughs> oh yeah, I think I was supposed to show a picture of it. Oh. It's it was a Smallville shirt. Oh. Yeah. Like it just said like the Smallville crows all over it. Oh. It looked like something like uh you'd get like the fabric. Hey! That's fucking Ken. Yeah, it is. It's from long legs. He does look like a spider. Oh my god, look at that hair. It is, isn't it? I'm pretty yeah. certain it is. Is this say cheese and die? Yeah, look at that camera. Look at that. Okay. Look at him, he's a baby. Oh my god. And die. I hope you captured my incredible juggling skills. Ah. Oh fuck. Are you okay? Oh my god, one. he's dead! <laughs> what? Tiny Toons was technically before Tasmania since it began before it. Mm. Gotcha. Got it. Say cheese and die. I can't Classic. I can't believe it. I what. didn't get to watch. I didn't Goosebumps? Watch, yeah. Like, I remember watching The Haunted Mask. Uh, yeah. Which, that was a primetime special. Yeah. I mean, they, they ended up playing it later also. Yeah. Um, but like I, I remember that but yeah. i didn't get to watch much more than that i don't think one, i could ever catch it my favorite one is when the the kids go trick-or-treating and like yeah the, we've the watched that one Jack together yeah. yeah i really like that one that one was good um but yeah i liked goosebumps i, I liked are you afraid of the dark a little bit better i think but i liked goosebumps i thought it was good you know shout out to rl stein uh 
Um, Unless he's a piece of shit. He might be. Uh, Nobody knows. Well, my brother told me, I think it was last year around this time, mm-hmm. that Arl Stein was, uh, I can't remember where at. Was it Texas or Virginia? I can't remember. He said that he really wanted me to go with him, but he knew the school was still going on. Mm. I was like, next time, just tell me. I'll go. Before you can learn the answers you seek, you must prove yourself worthy. Then you will learn the truth about the young man you saw. I think I think this is when he finds out he has a brother. Oh, well, yeah. does that I never, guy just magically have a bird on his? Arm? Yes. Wow. Yeah, mate. Zio was wild. All right. Yes, Zio. Oh God, that if we better not let that theme song play. <laughs> it always gets so us clean. Like oh my God. Yep, I did the same thing. <laughs> I did the same thing. <laughs> Oh, yeah. classic. <laughs> Spider Man! Spider Blood! Spider Blood! Radio. That's really cool. Radioactive Spider Bloods in this, this ship for our <laughs> Hey, full circle. We started with Rangers and now we have Rangers. <laughs> Whoa! I'm surprised they went with that. As the slogan's so hot, it's practically radioactive. I'm Quasimodo. Yeah, I'm just not a fan. I feel like I liked uh, Anastasia. More Anastasia than the Hunchback of Notre Dame. It's awesome. Yes. I loved Gummy Savers. Oh my god. Mm-hmm. So good. Basically, Jim Fisher and Jim Stahl were involved with Fox and they were friends with Howie Mandel. Hence, how Bobby's World basically just started. Just to Bobby's World! Thank you, Matt Z.R. <laughs> Matt Z.R. is on top of it, man. Let me tell you. He needs there... Wikipedia when you got Matt Z.R. Yeah, in I was going to say, he's Matt Wiki. Wickedy, wickedy, wickedy Matt. <gasps> oh, no. Not the JTT Pinocchio. I'm ready. Yeah. <sighs> Jonathan Taylor Thomas, The Adventure Story. Pinocchio. How about carving that girlfriend? Rady G. Whoa, that no, was no, gross. Gross. <laughs> <laughs> Get your dick wet. <laughs> you just assume <laughs> that he's going to carve you out a girl that's going to like you immediately. <laughs> hey, mate. Was, was his girlfriend made of what? Oh, my God. <laughs> Hey, I Pogs? remember those. Uh, oh, they're medallions. A medallion. I miss As Pogs. Fred said. I miss Pogs. Oh, yeah, Killer Tomatoes. Check it out. Oh, wow, so this is on a Saturday? There you go, Maggie. There you go, that's better. Man, Zio was on another level. Like... The random shit that they put into this show was just insane. It was insane. It was insane. It was insane? Yeah. Like, why Why does Tommy all of a sudden have a brother? And, like, I don't know. Maybe it's because I was a child and didn't understand things. But I feel like it made absolutely no sense. But that's the thing with, uh, like, kids shows, especially. And also in anime, like, all of a sudden, <gasps> there's a secret sibling. <laughs> or, oh, there's more uh like in sailor mm. Man, there's more scouts like power rangers there's more power rangers he, he couldn't control his zord because mm. he because he was like he wasn't there like he wasn't there i don't know he wasn't there. like he wasn't connecting with his zord or some shit oh okay so like that's why he had to go find his brother or some shit i don't know oh my god third annual ice cream at allen del matt it matches her dress Wow. Fun Games fest. and prizes? It's part of Fun Fest. Hot air balloons. Free toast from Coca-Cola and free ice cream from Pets. 
Oh, I don't want to go. Can I get a tasty frosty? Little Caesars. Oh man. Shit, this deal's getting Where's better this party? All, all the time. Wait, we need to go. Ellendale, by the way, is an old mansion around where we live, and it's used for every venue, possible weddings. Yeah, it's lame. And it's just a really, I'll put it this way, it's just a really old farm, and people pay a lot of money to just have stuff at it. It's, it's terrible. <sighs> yeah. Just to get married near a barn. And then, like, <laughs> and then after this, Maggie, they were like... That's when the Gold Ranger stuff really started happening. Yeah. And uh, so when they bring in Jason, they made him look like Tommy's brother. Just to make you think, like, oh, oh it's going to be Tommy's brother. But now it's Jason. Excuse me. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh. Uh, I have I have puppets. that. I mean, I don't know if I still have it. You probably but don't. But I, I did have the the puppet of him. I had that one for some reason because it squirts water again i had a lot of bullshit about wow, hunchback the and animation hated on him looked really good yeah man kidvid was kid solid Vid, i loved him i always felt kidvid was bigger than the burger king kids club like he could have had his I mean, own show he has an apple vision pro on i mean i mean, can't can't beat it think about it there's nothing cooler <laughs> than kidvid like kidvid is like if zach morris fucked all right. <laughs> uh, let's see. Matt CR says it's funny too, since some things uh, do need to look up via wiki, but some things like with Power Rangers and Smallville, a lot of stuff is just stuck in my memory databanks. <laughs> nice, Matt CR. He also said the Red Battle Zord was telepathically controlled, much like how the Alien Rangers controlled their battle boards. Yeah. Eric said <laughs> from pa Austin Powers, "Daddy wasn't there. I don't know the." tune to that one daddy dink, 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 daddy wasn't there to change my underwear cheesosaurus never really cared touchstone that's a daddy wasn't that's a disney there. that's a disney movie basically d to the a to the ddy d to the a to the ddy you gotta want something you've got a daddy issue here's a daddy tissue D to the A to the D D Y. Daddy. Daddy. <laughs> the best thing about Austin Powers and Goldmember <laughs> is the deleted musical sequence. Oh God. Uh, what's it all about, Austin? Mm. Fantastic. Fantastic. Rob Lowe comes back and has sex with his future self. <laughs> It's so weird. Yes, it is weird. But it's great. I love it. I love it so much. Yeah, there's his brother. <gasps> it's his brother. Whoa. The power is inside him all along. You better fast forward it because this always gets us cleaned. <laughs> I'm your brother. I'm not gonna lie. This is pretty cool. <laughs> no, no, I was, that's not what I was going to say. I, in fact, I, was, I think I was going to say the exact opposite of that. Oh, it's lame. Well, I mean, it's just Christmas. <laughs> Terrific. It's it's Christmas in Jamal. Have a fabulous world. It's terrific. Oh, don't you know? Wait, they did more? Uh. <laughs> wow. Now we pause for station identification. But audience is now deaf. Uh. <laughs> totally for kids. Oh man, I love the totally for kids. Something's happening right now. <laughs> like, I think I don't the know tape what's happening. is deciding whether or not to just cut. <laughs> the tape started skipping. 
<laughs> which is not a thing tapes do. Tapes don't do this. Nobody puts whole slices of apples in Frosted Flakes. Matt, they just Nobody want Nobody puts whole slices they're, of they're apples. They're like, hey, you know what? Everybody puts bananas. Let's try apples. <laughs> apples and milk. Yep, that works. VR Troopers, Maggie. We yeah. are VR. I want to go, Brooke. <laughs> Brooke. <laughs> Monster Channel. You've had enough of the all rubber nose channel. It's Matt. You can't even take the all furry. It's Garfield Gazorpa. It's a It's a Geraldo. Come on down, come to the place where fun never ends. Yes, come on in, it's time to remember Garfield, Garfield and Friends. Friends. Garfield and Friends. Friends. Garfield and Friends. And you should definitely watch it. <laughs> and you should definitely eat a piece oh. of lasagna. Ah. <gasps> we can't play the theme music, man. <laughs> man, those dreams. <laughs> look, aw, look at Alpha's little sleeping cat. Aw. We've detected no disturbances, Tommy. You know what my favorite thing is, man? You know what my favorite thing is, man? What? Uh, this whole thing kind of comes out of nowhere, right? Yeah. And, like, you know, we're dealing with, like, oh, Tommy is going to be an actor, I guess, in that one episode. And then, like, yeah. oh, now, like, you know, he's, he's Power he's Rangers. He's grandpa. You know, he's, he's doing, like, a spirit <laughs> walk and stuff. And then, like, in Turbo, he's like, I drive race cars now. <laughs> He's had many and I'm life a mechanic. Crises. I'm a Crisis, mechanic. Crises. I graduated and now I'm a mechanic that drives race cars. <laughs> and that's just who I am. And now I quit. I'm leaving. Goodbye. What, Eric asked, were those GoBots? <laughs> they looked like GoBots. I'm not going to lie. They looked like GoBots. But yeah. Man, and then, and then at some David point. Frank. His at hair some point, is beautiful. At some point. At some he, point. He... Goes and studies dinosaurs and becomes a professor. All right. So, hey, Tommy is a jack of all trades. Okay? I guess, but then he then that stops and he's just a Beringer still. UFC fighter. You know? uh, I mean, that was real life. <laughs> I know. <laughs> just trying to be funny. <laughs> Jesus doesn't tap, Maggie. Don't forget it. I know. <gasps> my mother. Never sneak up on a man and sleeping on an ironing board. Oh, wow. I liked There's a lot a of stupid <laughs> shit as a kid. It was time for the annual Anderson family vacation. <laughs> Just wow. how they drew Louie as a kid always cracked me up. <laughs> dad! Oh, Dad! Oh, Dad! Dad! Oh, I need to go pee, Dad! Oh, Are we dad! there yet, Dad? Dad! Oh, Dad! Oh, Dad! Oh dad! God. Hey, Dad! I'll get the door, Dad. Why bother? I got a free toe. Later, Kelly. Later, Later Kelly. Kelly. Later, Later, Kelly. Later, Kelly. No, Grandma. We'll be Grandma's right. dead. She became a bad bee. <laughs> Dang it, Matt. Maggie, there was an episode of Live with Louie where his, <laughs> his grandma, grandpa, one of them die. And he can't deal with it. Aww. And so he meets a bunch of, uh, like, monks. Yeah. And they explain to him what reincarnation is. Ooh. And so he, he then goes into the, the playground at school and is, like, telling everybody to, like, stay away from the bees because they're his grandma or some Aww. shit. Yeah. It's really sad, but, like, it's also, like... It's it's like portrayed as hilarious because yeah. he's just a dumb fucking <laughs> kid. A kid. You know? yeah. But still, yet yeah, though, that's sweet. I guess. <laughs> Stay away from my grandma. <laughs> but pretty much, you know what? I know why I'm going. There's okay every Dad! year. Every year on the playground at school, there's there's bees. Okay, it's the wood bees. Bees. Like, bees. B e e s. Beads. I have a kid this year that freaks out. If he sees it, hears it, he freaks. If the bee's like five miles away from him, he freaks. So tomorrow I'm going to say, you know what? That's my grandma flying. 
I probably wouldn't. I might. I, pro- I probably wouldn't I do might. that. I might do that. Oh, it's Cold Finger. Ah. Uh, cold Finger. I'm pretty sure they even um, said that. Eric says, uh, Eric asks, so is Tommy Oliver the equivalent of Barbie with all those careers? Hey, yes. He is. He's just Tommy. Everywhere else he be salami. Oh wow. No. Or not to go in here. <laughs> Matt CR says, Well, Tommy was still living in Reefside last we knew, so maybe he was still being a teacher. They just didn't bother to say mom. Ah, uh, that's it. What? I think that's it. Dang, that was I feel like that was short. Well, I mean it's five and a half hours. But like there wasn't a lot of commercials. No, so there wasn't a lot of stuff past we could watch. Matt was lame. Hey, you know what? <laughs> if you got it, flaunt it. Yeah, there you have nothing to flaunt. Bony, bony. Step right up and strut your stuff. Yeah. People say that honesty is a virtue. Hey, so everybody, let me show you this picture, of Billy. <laughs> <laughs> hey, everybody, uh, he would, look at this picture. He would, he would Billy. want me to show. He would want me to show everyone the the shirt that he was supposed to have for the show. Had the show been today like he thought it was. Uh, Aww. Yeah, there Poor Bills are. Here's, here's another. There we go. Oh, it was like a button up? That's cool. Yeah. Yeah. It arrived today. Yep. Hey, did anybody see that they have emulators on? <laughs> God, on this now? has blown his it's mind crazy, out man. of the water today. I mean, like, I, you know, I didn't, I haven't played anything on it because I don't have ROMs. Yeah, but gotcha. If you had ROMs, yeah, you could play like everything, any Nintendo game. Mm-hmm. <laughs> like, it's crazy. The things I've seen yeah. other people play. Yeah. It's crazy. It's unreal, isn't it? It's like there was a Sailor Moon game. <gasps> it's crazy, Maggie. Oh, my God. I the play. Nintendo DS yeah. on your iPhone. It's Holy wild. Crap. It's wild. Let me tell you. Uh, the Sum of All Fears at a, a Game Boy game. <laughs> it's real. That's a wow, real one. That's, that's a real one. I mean, they made games for everything, I feel, I feel like, back then. <sighs> You ain't joking. Like every movie, I think had a game or something. Oh it yeah. Seems like. Oh yeah. May, what's your favorite movie tie-in video game of all time? Uh, let's see. Okay, this is probably going to be random for you, like but it. it's only one. I'm already, I'm already liking it. I don't think you know what it is. I'm down. Uh, it's PlayStation Two. Spider Man Two. <laughs> nope. I think it's play that. I watched. I Sp- watched. You didn't play Spider Man too. No, oh, I watched. Oh man! I watched my brother play it, and I flipped through the game. God, he'd always get <laughs> Insomniac wishes they were as good as Spider Man too. Okay, I'm joking. Oh my god, they're better, but they're really. It's, it was great. PlayStation Two, Disney's Tarzan. <laughs> it was good. It was good. Nah. It was good. Nah. Hey, Game City Saver. Game City Saver. What up? Not, um, Eric, it's not CD ROMs, hun. I'm sorry. <laughs> he thinks it's CD ROMs that you're talking about. Oh, ROMs. Yeah. Uh, it's, it's, it's uh, like if you have a, a game cartridge, like the legal way, <laughs> there is a legal way to have ROMs. You are backing up, like, okay, because like Nintendo cartridges, right? Yeah. They're not going to last forever. No, they're not. But you bought it. Yeah. And you have every right to, to you have it. own it. So, like, like my Pokemon Red and Yellow and Blue, right? Like, I have yeah. those for Game Boy. But the battery's dead in it. Yeah. So, like, sure, I could change out the battery and yeah. be able to start new and stuff. Yeah. But, like, in 10 years, that battery's going to die again and I'm going to lose all my Pokemon again, right? But you can, you can save. You can basically rip the game from the cartridge. It's still on the cartridge. So, yeah. it's, like, it's like ripping a CD. Yeah. You know? So you you rip the files off mm-hmm. of it, and that's called a ROM. Yeah. And then you put those ROMs into an emulator. Yeah. Which emulates a console, mm-hmm. and that is how you would play something on there. Okay. Now that is how you would do it if you had the ROMs yourself. Yeah. I know. Now where it gets 
iffy is when people start downloading ROMs that they don't own. Ah. Uh, yeah. Man. Which would not be something to do. Not legal. Right. So there. you would not want to do that. You would not want to go to archive.org and okay. find okay. literally I, I every video game. Get your, I think I get what you're throwing. I'm just saying, game you wouldn't C- want to do that. Game C Sa- Saver says his movie tie-in game was Superman Returns game is better than the movie. <laughs> Ooh, I've not ever played that. That's cool. I've never played uh, it. And Eric says, speaking of movies, what are you guys doing tomorrow at 9 a.m.? Work. <laughs> uh He's talking about Transformers 1 trailer. Uh-huh. Maggie. Yeah, I know. I'm excited. I'll can I watch it without little... you? Yeah, you can. Okay. Can I watch it without you? No. No, I'm joking. <sighs> Bitch. I mean, here's what I might do. <laughs> depending on when it drops, depending on if I can take like my, my lunch break. and break and stuff at work, I might do like a like a like a short reaction. Mm-hmm. Like a first time watching, mm-hmm. you know, mm-hmm. maybe maybe either post it as a as like a short on YouTube or TikTok or something. I might do that, mm-hmm. you know. Sorry, I don't know. I've been going back and forth with trailer reactions. Like we used to do trailer reactions all the time, yeah, and it got hard to keep up with. Yeah, there's just too much. Like yeah. there's a lot that we like that we want to watch and stuff, but like yeah. we can't sit down and do trailer reactions one after the other yeah. i feel like it, it that part got overwhelming and in like itself. if we try and do it as soon as they drop which we i mean we can it's always the night of at the very yeah. least like then they start like stacking up and it's like well the whole point is to get it out when it first drops yeah so like is it really are we doing the best that we can yeah i've been thinking about our content a lot like this is kind of outside of the <laughs> 90s thing everybody um but you know, like the hopefully awesome show and like super nineties, like obviously you know reminiscing. Yeah, I feel like is is a lot of like a lot of what we do that people enjoy. Yeah, and uh, and yeah, so I don't know. Just been thinking about that. Like, do we need to change some things up? Maybe you know, yeah. make the hopefully awesome show a little bit different. Maybe okay, like still covering news, like yeah. the new stuff. But maybe making it more like a, a conversation with the spice audience. Spice it up. You know? Spice it up. As opposed to just like a straight news show. Spice up your life. Yeah, spice up your life. Uh, Matt Zier says, well, neither this tape or this... <laughs> neither this tape or last week's tape was the Master Vault one. Will we uh-huh. ever find it? We will find it. We will find it! Man, I'm still... Okay. Uh, no, my favorite... I, didn't, I never said what my favorite uh, movie tie-in game was. Uh, I mean, the, the obvious answer is Spider-Man 2. Yeah. But I feel like that's that's too easy. Yeah, it is. So, like, I'm going to say, like, I'm going to say my favorite movie tie-in video game of all time. Mm-hmm. And I believe this was on the Sega Genesis. Okay. It was either the Sega Genesis or the Super Nintendo, but I'm pretty sure it was the Genesis version. Mm. Mighty Morphin Power Rangers the movie. Yeah. Because they also, like, they fill in some extra yes. stuff with... Uh, when uh rocky and adam and uh aisha yeah, yeah. when they switch powers yeah. like you play through those those yeah. episodes also yeah that is right yeah yeah like i really liked that a lot i really really liked that hmm. uh tmnt turtles and tom not a tie-in <laughs> game but but uh, that game's a fucking banger let me tell you my god it's so good ps1 driver <laughs> 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 uh the pizza hut demo disc the pit pepsi man that had uh that had <laughs> tony hawk and metal gear solid it seemed like i had that a demo a disc with demo crash disc. bandicoot and I crash remember. team racing because that was a good one i too. don't know. spyro no i'm talking about a demo disc no i'm no that's what i'm saying there was they they had three there was three pizza hut demo discs there was oh. the first one that was just like it, it was just the first one yeah and then they released two that were at the same time Mm. and like one had like spyro one had uh crash yeah uh and like one of i think the original one had uh like uh gran turismo yeah like i think there was a demo of that like i didn't really understand demo whenever i got it yeah and then i just played through one level crash bandicoot and i'm like i want the rest but i never did crash warped let me tell you fucking love that um, game. Matt Ciara agrees with you that that Mighty Morphin Power Rangers game was pretty good. Oh, so good, man. So good. 
I mean, you know, it's crazy. If you owned the ROMs, you could play that game on your phone. Oh, Matt, you need to get Legally. the ROMs. Legally. If you uh, if you have the ROMs let, att- obtained legally, because the app's on there, and like Apple allows it now, yeah, it's crazy. Because it emulation itself is not is not wrong. Yeah, emulation itself is not wrong. This is an archiving thing, just like how we're archiving, archiving these VHS tapes, yeah. and you can get access to the archives by joining our Patreon or becoming a member right here on YouTube.com slash Hopefully Awesome. Five bucks <laughs> get you the, the Google friends. archives, get you your name in the credits, get you all kinds of fun stuff. Everybody. Party on. It's going to be a good time. Hey, uh, this is it. We did it. Maggie, we made it through the week. You know what we're going to do tomorrow night? I'm going to go sleep. You're going to go sleep. I'm going to feed Henry and then I'm going to pass the fuck out. Let me tell you. It's going to be glorious. Uh, yeah, that's probably going to happen to me tonight. I'm probably going to feed Henry glorious, and fall asleep. Glorious! But yeah, uh, this tape will be up tomorrow morning. So uh, if you're on the archives, I've been trying to figure out if I need to start like posting like, hey, it's up. Or like if just people just check into the, the folder uh, itself. I would post updates because sometimes uh, some people turn off their notifications on Google. Yeah, that's a good point. So point. I would I would put up a uh, special shout out to Strange Marvel Theories for being our producer for the month. We greatly appreciate you, Strange Marvel <gasps> Theories, for your support. You are fantastic. Oh, God. Uh, remember, we'll be back again on Monday with the Hopefully Awesome Show, where we'll be covering all of the latest news. Be on the lookout tomorrow for a uh, Transformers One reaction of some sorts. Um, and then uh, this weekend we got a couple of videos posting on Saturday and Sunday. So be sure and check those out. Give them a like. We greatly appreciate it. And uh, next Tuesday, we'll be back with Smallville, Season 5, Episode 4, Aqua. Aqua, man. Dresses like a fish. I can yeah. dig it. And then, uh, of course, one week from tonight, we'll be back again with another VHS tape back for it again. Super 90s Playback. Uh, but that Oops. is it, everybody. We hope you all enjoyed. We hope you all had fun. Uh, Eric says, great show, guys. Thanks for the good times. Hey, Eric, Thanks. let the good times roll. Let the good times roll. Let the good times roll. Is that how the song goes? Let the good times roll. Yeah, that's it. Let the good times Did you know roll. Lead singer of Queen Dodd. Yeah. Thanks for watching, <laughs> and as always, have a hopefully awesome day. <laughs> Bye.